Hi everyone, Liz here, thanks for stopping by. So I've got a parcel to show you and part of a little stash um, that I need to try and get done for Christmas. Oh, <laughs> something else to do for Christmas. Anyway, uh, yes, yeah, so this one is from AliExpress. I'll show you this one in a second. And then these, these are some that I've got for Christmas presents and they're from uh, GBFKE. Um, I did actually get the parcel last week and I'm going to leave the rest of it because it's quite a big haul um, till after Christmas now with me doing my advent and everything. I'm not sure I'll get time to do it. But I did want to show you these because they are quite, um, although it's going off the boil a bit more now, uh, but yeah, they are quite uh, relevant at the moment and the ones that I want to do for Christmas for people. Okay, so you can see there we're a keychain. So we've got one, two, three, four, Four keychains, have we? Let's have a look. And they are squid games. Ooh, they're really sticky. So that's one, two, three. Oh, that one's got a bit creased up. And four. Whoa, look at that. Uh, I don't know whether you've watched Squid Games, but that absolutely frightened me to death. <laughs> I think, to be honest, if I had seen that stood at the end of that playground, I would have run anyway before she started being nasty. There's just no way seeing a doll that size. I would have just completely, oh no, no, I couldn't have done that. So that's the uh, doll from Squid Games. Um, she is a key ring. So yeah, oh, the little thing hasn't punched out there is a little place for the key ring to go through there but it's not quite punched out they are very very sticky and um, as i've said on a previous key ring unboxing i do think that they're doing these all so fast now that they're putting the tops on before the glue glue's sort of settled and cured a bit and um, so yeah it's really sticky in fact it's not as sticky on the legs as it is on the edges and um, so yeah i think they're just churning them out but then if they're popular i suppose they've got to make the money where they can so yes yeah, so that's the uh, huge girl from squid games and yes if you've not seen it compared to a person she is well that size these aren't really to scale but then we've got the guards in their little red track suits which are the round the square and the triangle and uh, yeah i thought they're just quite cute they've done them as like um, bubble heads as it were, so they're, they're a big head one. Um, but yeah, very clear symbols. And they are all double-sided as well. So, you know, they'll want sealing once they're done. Because if you're going to use them as a keychain, then uh, yeah. But I just thought it's just like a little extra gift, just a bit of fun. Um, I just liked them, so I had to get them. So that's the keychains. Oof, sticky, sticky, sticky the little girl next to it there and I did get two sets as well because I needed eight if you're gonna get one you might as well get another one let's have a look at the toolkit very basic toolkit enough to do your project you've got your pick up <laughs> my hands escaping even the pen don't want to go near the, do the doll look <laughs> uh, no multi places or anything just your basic uh, pink pen with your what, single place around the end then we have got the lovely lobster claw, claw clasps with your little chain as well. So you can use either or if you want to use them together. Okay. And there's one, two, three, four. Oh, we've got five. Oh, we've got a spare. Oh, that's always handy. So we've got one, two, three, four. Five. Oh no, that's interesting. So we've got a spare one. We'll have a look at the other kit uh, just to double check that uh, if we've got a spare or whether that's just an extra that they're putting in or whether uh, it should have been in there or not. Little tiny bit. Of, it's red wax though, so it does tend to be a little bit stickier than the very clear see-through. Here, yeah, let's have a look at these drills. So, whoa. Okay. So the girl, um, her face and her Oh no, her arms are diamond painted and her legs. So her face isn't diamond painted, but it looks like the rest of her is going to be all in uh, crystals. So our Alex crystals as well. What's the thing? Oh yeah, look, her legs are going to be like that um, 
champagne colour. Ooh. Okay. And her arms. Okay. Ooh, that's a different colour to do for, uh, well, it's a doll, I suppose, not a person. So we've got the lemon crystal, which will be her top. We've got that, which is her arms and her legs. We've got X. Oh, no. So where does that one go then? Y. Where's Y? Oh, no. All right. So <laughs> okay. Um, her arms are the lemon crystal. Her legs are the like champagne, darkish champagne crystal. Then her top is the yellow and her smock is the orange. So she's going to be all in crystals. Very blingy. Okay, then we've got some little tiny red ones. So where do they go? They must be on the men, I think. Uh, that one is T. So where's T? Oh, right. She's got T. <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> can see this T in her hair on the end of her plaits and just to the side of her head there so that's some little like purpley dots there that go in her hair then we've got the uh, gems with the silver backs the black with the silver backs which will go on all three. Oh, will they or is there just no I think that's just right it's just taking me ages looking through <laughs> trying to find where the O goes and it is just a stripe across on the uh, guard's little like face meshes there. So what that's all about, I'm not quite sure. Um, because I do believe that they will be exactly the same as the uh, black gems. I'll be, I guess, like, you know, they're exactly the same. So we'll see what they look like when they're done. Um, I will show you them when they're done and I will have to seal them as well. Uh, then we've got your white, which will go on the uh, round the circle and the triangle on the uh, guard's faces. Now, they actually are what um, determines what sort of guard they are in the programme. And then the red sparkly, so they're all going to be red sparkly. So they look pretty decent gems as well. Oh, they look like they're quite a, a nice quality, but we'll see when we do them. Let's just have a quick look. And let's see if we've got the extra key rings in this one as well. So we've got the same. Ooh, blah, 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 blah. very sticky still. Eesh. Yeah, one, two, three, four. Yeah, so we've still got the same four little characters there. We've got the same gems. And then let's just count these out. We haven't got a hole in this bag. <laughs> this one's not trying to escape. <laughs> and one, two, three, four, five. Yes, so you get a spare keychain and lobster claw clasping each one. Um, and actually, these aren't um, particularly cheap to buy because they are quite a nice quality one. You know, they're quite a heavy one, so that's good. Um, yeah, so if you're wanting. If uh, possibly you break one or you're wanting to add something onto another project, make uh, one of your other diamond painting little things into a keyring, you can do. So yeah, quite impressed with those. Um, I'll put the link to them down below. So let me just tidy these up and then I'll show you my other purchase. Okay, so this one isn't diamond painted, but it is Scotty Dog Crafts related, sort of. <laughs> Okay, so what I've actually got is a 3D illusion lamp and it is a little Scotty dog. Now, unbeknown to me, when I actually ordered this, and this is because I don't read things properly when I order them. Oh, I've got my hair tie around my arm. <laughs> um, I thought I'd ordered two full lamps, but when I've gone back and looked at my order, I have actually only I had actually only ordered the two little stands. I didn't order the base that lights up. I just I love that one. I don't, you won't be able to see that very well. Uh, that box black, yeah. There you are. You can see it better there. Look, a little fat Scotty dog. I'd only ordered these, but because I'd ordered the two, the lovely company that sent me them has actually sent me one base. Um, so that was really, really kind of them because I'd not realised that, that I'd not ordered that. 
Okay, so I'll show you this one as well. So that's one Scotty dog I've ordered, which is like a forward facing Scotty dog. And then, as I say, the other one is a little fat round one. And when you stand them up, they're supposed to be like a 3D light set. I'd only ordered. Um, yeah, sorry, I just had to go looking for the wire. <laughs> okay, so if you've got any of your bases, um, quite a few of the Christmas lights do these and a few of the other different um, 3D projects that you can get diamond painted have these as well. So I have only got one stand with two dogs but possibly I won't use both together or possibly after Christmas I can use the stand from the Christmas one. So you can put batteries in them, they take three AAA batteries um, but don't use the batteries or don't have the batteries in at the same time as you're using the electricity. I'll just switch that off for a second. Oops, it's got a few different settings as well this. Um, if you're not very good with lights flashing or whatever then possibly turn away but then it just literally stands in the base and it shines. Let me put the black behind it again so you can see it a bit better. And it goes from all different colours and that's the base doing that and then when you look at these from a distance you can't quite catch it on camera but they do look really 3D, they're really good. They do like dinosaurs and all sorts of different ones. Um, and this does have different settings as well for leaving it on one colour, having it flashing faster um, and all sorts. So, yeah, I was really impressed with this, but I was really impressed with the company. The fact that because I had not read it properly, I did just order the two plates to go in the light. And because I'd ordered the two, they actually did send me one base and all the cables and everything as well. So let's just have a quick look at the other one. I do like the little fat round one best, but this is quite um, nilly-ish looking. And again, it just slots in there. Hopefully you can see. Oh, it just looks like evil eyes looking at you through the camera. <laughs> I've just got it on the steady colour change, so you know I'm not uh, harming anybody, hopefully, that uh, can't see flashing lights. So I just thought with it being Scotty Dog Crafts, I do collect an awful lot of Scotty stuff. I thought you might like to just see my little Scotty lights as well. Um, they have got a film over them as well, which I've not taken off yet. Because I've not decided where I'm going to put them yet. But yeah, just a little bit of fun. Okay, so we'll switch that one off. Pop that on there. Right, so I shall just pop this away. As I say, uh, read instructions, read... Um, Read your description of the things that you're ordering before you actually add them. <laughs> don't do like me and don't read it. <laughs> and I just thought, oh, that's a bit of a swizz just getting two of those. Um, but yeah, it, it was my fault. So that's my two Scotties and my Squid Games. Which, oh, that doll, it just is so freaky. And my little Squid Games figures. <laughs> Okay, well, I hope you've enjoyed seeing these. Uh, if you have, giving me a thumbs up would be much appreciated. Uh, it just lets me know that uh, I'm on the right track and that uh, you're enjoying seeing my videos. And if you want to come back and see what I get up to next and see these completed, then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner down here and the little bell next to it, you'll be notified when my next videos come out. So thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.